Castle Clash, how's it going tonight? I have the winner of the Smurf account giveaway here for this video. Um, if you remember, I uh, challenged people on YouTube to guess what's in my tower. And nobody guessed perfect, but somebody guessed very, very close. And so he's going to be the winner. I told you I would give it away on Friday no matter what. So here it is. Um, I also have some pretty cool stuff for you for this video. Something I discovered while doing a competition in White Knights Guild, which is ranked number 5 right now, by the way. How awesome is that? We're gaining on number 4, too. So look out, Cole. Here we come. Um, so anyways, I'll do the giveaway competition. I'm going to do a, a really cool dungeon run for you here in a second. And, uh, and yeah, and maybe, maybe I'll do a couple arena runs or something like that too. So I'm going to hold off on telling you who the winner is just yet. Let you guys speculate on that tower for just a little bit longer. There it is right there. One green, two blues, and three purple. Like I said, nobody guessed perfect, but somebody guessed very, very close, and so he's going to be the winner because I put a time limit on this on this challenge. All right, so what happened was I challenged my guild to do a um, dungeon runs in 30 minutes, how many shards we could get, because I had just finished a challenge, uh, a uh, shard uh, farming challenge in... Um, stolen fire guild i was talking to them all online chat great bunch of people and uh i ended up farming 300 shards in an hour in an hour that was crazy i just got way lucky in the dungeon drops and so anyways i went back to white knights and we did a mini competition just like it we did it in 30 minutes and uh i made a mistake while i was farming those dungeons and uh i dropped in here be mon or in uh, dungeon uh, eight skull eleven the thirty seven shard dungeon I don't know why we still call them skulls because they're not anymore I did something pretty interesting everybody when we do the thirty second dungeon runs does it using frenzy well I on accident didn't drop frenzy and I still was able to do a thirty or a thirty second run so here we're gonna give it a try and see if I can do it. I might not get 30 seconds, but I should get pretty close as long as it happens just like it did when I was farming those shards. Let's hope for it, see it. I got Pumpkin Duke triple stacked doing this without Frenzy. I couldn't believe it. So let's see if we can do it again. It's going to take some luck. It looks like I just lost Pumpkin Duke, so probably not. Yeah, we're already past 30 seconds, way past 30 seconds. I'll do a refresh on Pumpkin Duke, and we'll try it again. And uh, see if we can't get it to work out. Because, yeah, this is already way past 30 seconds. There goes Thunder God taking out a couple towers. Here's Spirit Midge taking out another tower. Boom. Nice. So let's revive him and let's try that one more time. I really want to see if I can't get that on video. And like I said, guys, I haven't, I'm not sitting here re-recording and re-recording over and over again until I get it so I can show you. This is the first time I'm trying it since the competition. So, you know, you're getting firsthand what it is. I'm not trying to get the perfect video to put on YouTube. You know, this is this is what it what it was. I was just sitting here farming and farming and farming and then boom, a 30 second dungeon without frenzy. I couldn't believe it. Here we go. Let's see if we can do it this time. Or even get close. Spirit Mage goes. Here comes Pumpkin Duke again, maybe. Thunder God's taking out a bunch. And this one's going to take way longer, too. Hmm. What did I do different? I don't know. Anyways, guys, I'm going to keep trying this out. Either way, even if it does take longer than 30 seconds right now, I'm doing this dungeon with only one magic and it's the cheaper of the two magics that are typically used which means that I'm using less gold to do the same dungeon and to me that's just awesome I'll go ahead and do it for the video I mean one more time I've, I'm uh, I lost Thunder God that first one but that was that was kind of a mistake on my part but let's let's check I mean I'm gonna do this run a couple more times and let's see, you know, if we can get it, 
you know, a pretty good rate on this without using Frenzy. I mean, that's that's kind of a cool deal. Not that I don't mind using Frenzy. I mean, you know me. I'm, I'm all about using magic. I don't mind. Oh, this one's going to be pretty close. Look at that. If we can guess if Spirit Mage would proc one more time. Oh, there's one building left sitting out over there. Not bad, though, right, guys? I mean, this is without Frenzy doing the 37 shard dungeon. A lot of people, when they do use only one magic, they do it with just Frenzy. You know, they don't do it just Guardian Angel. So this is this is pretty dang cool in my book. Or at least I think so. Maybe Maybe you guys can do some more impressive stuff. I don't know. But I feel like I'm doing pretty good with this. So, and yeah, like I said, this was just a pure mistake. I just forgot to drop Frenzy. <laughs> and this happened. Let's get Pumpkin Duke going. Maybe he can triple stack here in just a second. Or double stack. And yeah, we're past 30 seconds again. I promise it happened, guys. I do. I'm going to get in on video. It's my mission now. I'm going to keep going until I do. Boom. Spirit Mage takes out the last tower, and that's that. I can't believe I didn't get any drops right there. Did I get a single drop? None. Wow, I think that was like five dungeon runs and nothing. Anyways, guys, that's that. Now to the tower. The moment you've all been waiting for. What was inside of it? And so many people have been so bugged by this tower sitting out of here. I even had some of my guild members... Beg to be let me drop my shield so that they could attack this tower just because it's bothered them so much sitting out like that. I went and stuck all my heroes around there and he attacked it. He couldn't even get to the tower. <laughs> my heroes defended it. So there you guys go. The YouTube tower sitting right here. <laughs> I think that's what I'm going to call it. The YouTube tower. What's inside? Here you go. Succubus, Marksman, and Werewolf. That's who was in there. <laughs> Congratulations. Uh, the person who won, he guessed um, Succubus, Werewolf, and Frost Witch. And, because, and now there was a couple people who guessed Werewolf and, and uh, Marksman. But because they didn't guess Succubus, and she's the legendary, she was the three-pointer on this thing. She got, she got three points, Werewolf two points, and Marksman one point. Uh, the guy who won, and I'm not even going to bother trying to say your name because I'm going to butcher it. Um, but, uh, you did an awesome job. You got the most points out of it, so congratulations. You win the Smurf account. Here, since I can't pronounce your name, let's switch over and I'll show you right here. This is you. If this is you, message me. You win. Congratulations. There you go. I'm going to hit reply right now. And there you have it, guys. He won. He was the first one. Get a hold of me, buddy. I'll get you that Smurf account. I'm very happy for you. <laughs> and uh, you'll have to tell me how to say your name, too. Um, Mr. Bork. We'll just go by that. Mr. Bork. There you go. So that's that, guys. Thank you for participating in the Smurf Account Challenge. I really appreciate it. Um, again, I really appreciate all of your support that's been, you know, you guys have been giving me throughout this YouTube experience of mine. Wow, my Cupid is now number one on my list. That's new. She just hit level 120. Cool. Um, but yeah, thanks for your support. I appreciate all the all of you who are subscribing. I've been getting some awesome messages from people online chat contacting me, just saying hi, letting me know that uh, they're enjoying my vids, or you know, asking questions. And I really appreciate that, guys. I mean, that's that's so so important to me that you guys actually care and. Uh, want to want to watch my videos um like i like i always say if it wasn't for you guys um supporting me in this i would never be doing youtube videos i would have stopped a long time ago um and yes i realize i just started but uh but yeah guys so thank you for your support i really appreciate it if you guys want to see more videos if you have some ideas let me know um also, on guild shoutouts and stuff like that, guys, please realize I've got a long list of people who are um, asking me to do guild shoutouts and whatnot. And uh, I'm trying to get to you as fast as possible. Please be patient. 
and realize that uh, I will be there as soon as I can and uh, I'm making videos as fast as I can I hope you guys can realize that so that's it guys thank you so much for watching I'm out I think I've said that like 10 times already today um, anyways that's that see you guys <laughs>